Taurus, welcome to Femacy Lighthouse. We're gonna be taking a look at what it is that you need to know to book a private session. All of that info can be found in the description box below of this video. Let's get started. Spirit, please provide me with messages for Taurus. The Six of Wands energy coming out here first. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, not everyone's dealing with a fire sign. However, this is a card of victory, Taurus. All right, so something's going to be going your way. There could be someone traveling to you. This could be a family member, some type of conversation that takes place between you and somebody else with the Ace of Swords here. Someone's trying to make something clear to you. All right, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, tell me more. What is this Ace of Swords all about for Taurus? Tell me more about this Ace of Swords energy. The Three of Wands, somebody who has been waiting and watching. They don't want to do that anymore, all right? This person also feels like little by little, you have just been focused on something else and not so much focused on them for some reason. They feel like your back is kind of turned to them. So I don't know what that means for you guys. However, this person doesn't care if your back is turned because they're still on their way to you. All right, with the Six of Wands, Ace of Swords, to that Three of Wands energy. Tell me more for Taurus. The Knight of Swords. So you have two different energies that are coming at you here. You have somebody over here that has some sort of idea of how to get your attention. And then I feel like there's another energy coming at you at the same time. So we have two forces trying to get you to see something. What is that? Spirit, what does this Knight of Swords want? What does this Knight of Swords want here? The Four of Wands. This looks like a meetup. Someone's coming to visit you soon, or they would like to. There's like a get together that I'm seeing here. And I feel like both of these energies are here, this fire sign and this air sign. Now, keep in mind, this is not always a love reading. I always say that because I have new people that come in to watch every day, all right? So this could be about some event that's coming up pretty soon or something like that. You're going to be a part of it is what I'm getting. So it's like these two people are going to be at that event is what I'm getting. Okay, so this fire sign, this air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, they want you to be a part of this, whatever it is. I don't know. And you guys are like meeting up somewhere. Tell me more. Talk to me about this Four of Wands for Taurus. The moon with Pisces. You're not sure about it though. Clarify the moon. The Seven of Pentacles energy. You're disappointed about something. These people are trying to convince you. Someone's trying to convince you or they will be trying to get you to do something that you are unsure about. I don't know what that has to do with Taurus, but the, people are trying to convince you here in this energy is what I'm getting. Who's trying to convince Taurus? Who is this? Who's trying to convince Taurus? A fire sign is coming out here heavy. That's why it's very important to know your person's chart if you're watching in reference to love or whatever because they could be an air sign with fire in their chart, you know what I mean? And then you won't know that. So um, verifying someone's chart is very, very important because we have more fire here than anything. Six of wands, four of wands, three of wands, queen of wands. Clarify the queen of wands. 
What does this Queen of Wands want? This Queen of Wands, there's a desperate energy from this person, okay? I'm going to tell you right now. Why is this energy so desperate? Can you please clarify this Two of Wands energy for Taurus because of the Six of Wands? What are you doing, Taurus, that has everybody all up in your business? Because now we have the Six of Wands two times, which means that something's going really well for you, Taurus. Something in your life. You may not view it like that, but people from the outside are very proud of you for the way that you continue to carry on in the midst of obstacles. It's like you're going to keep going and you use those situations to propel you. So victory two times. Does somebody want a part of that victory? I feel like somebody wants something from you. They want you to attend this thing. There's ideas. These people are talking about you, but it's not in a negative way. It's like you see what Taurus is doing or Taurus is doing better than Taurus was and something like that. Let's get Taurus. There's travel here, period. Either you're traveling to these people or they're traveling to you. I actually feel like you, you're going to go to this event, whatever it is. They're trying to convince you or they will be trying to convince you, but I feel like you attended whatever that is. Tell me more. This is interesting. Tell me more. Spirit. So we have the Ace of Cups, the Nine of Cups, the Five of Swords. It's like somebody is mad that they can't have their way with you, Taurus. All right. Five of Swords, Nine of Cups, Ace of Cups. This person, they're concealing the way that they really feel or they're watching you fulfill your dreams. And it's like they're not able to pursue their dreams. I don't know why. I don't know why they're not able to do that. It seems like they would like to be doing something that you're doing. Who is this person around you? I know that we come to these readings for love often, but it's also important to be attentive to these other energies around us that are looking at us with the five of swords, nine of cups, ace of cups. So you feel all of this for me, but you're pulling up as somebody that feels like you need to be defensive. Who is that person? Okay. Let's see what else we have. Tell me more. What about love for Taurus? What about love? The King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I just did a Sagittarius reading. Okay, so you wanna check that out. Tell me more. Why the King of Wands? Temperance, Sagittarius. Yo, I cannot make this shit up. I know it's dark in here, but I like to make the whole thing intimate, which is why I don't have like all the lights on so that you can be in peace while you watch this. You know what I mean? Temperance coming out. Whether it's a fire sign or not, what does this person want from Taurus? What do they want? Spirit, what do they want? The five of wands, really? Oh no, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. They're over there trying to start problems or they got problems. I don't know if they want to talk to you about a problem or if this person got beef, okay? So yeah, you are definitely needing to take your time before you decide how you want to move forward with somebody in your life that's going through this five of wands or I don't know if they're trying to start problems. 
Don't let these people instigate you. You're better than that. You know, fighting is only a setback. It's only going to delay your progress. Let me clarify this five of wands. What is this five of wands, please? Why is the five of wands here? with the King of Wands and the Temperance. Why is the Five of Wands here? Because of the High Priestess. Now you tell me, Taurus, who's the High Priestess, right? That's you. You're the High Priestess. You're the spiritual one watching this. Look at her. Doesn't she remind you of yourself? Whether male or female, gender does not matter, but you feel me. Priestess, priest, counselor, therapist, the one that people go to. They're conflicted over something that you're involved in or that you're doing. Tell me more. Five of Pentacles. Chariot. Cancer Energy. What else? The Magician. Gemini. The Sun. Four of Cups. I don't know what's going on with this person. And then at the bottom of the deck, another version of the High Priestess with the Hierophant. What more can I say? I mean, I feel like, and then we have Scorpio energy right behind that. Pisces energy right after that. They can't stop thinking about you. I don't care what they say. Communication. You got to expect it. Somebody's going to try to convince you about something. I want to see, you know, what you're going to do about that. Because they want you to go to some party or some trip or something. Okay. You see, look at all this fire to the nine of pentacles. All right, that's what I have for you, Taurus, to book a private session. All of that info is below. Take care.